Hey, it's Tori from Mommy Bar, and I'm gonna start a little series here on getting ready for baby because that is what we're doing here. I'm 38 weeks today, and finally found I had lost all of the um, bolts for the crib when we moved. So for like a month and a half, I was buying every single thing I could online. I had the exact measurements, but nothing matched. And right before I was about to run out to a store yesterday as my last hope, I opened up the little nightstand here because I knew it was in there. And I figured out how to pull out the drawer and I found the bolts. Oh my gosh, I yelled so loudly. I was so excited. Isn't that true? Did you hear me yell? Yeah, here's my guy to help me. So, um, let me just do a little recap in this video. 38 weeks today, and what has been different this pregnancy compared to the, my, when I was pregnant with this guy? Um, near the end, I really feel like everybody's rushing the baby to come, which with my, my boy here, my Ruben, I remember being so anxious and so excited and just like, come on, baby, it's time to come out, like at 36 weeks. And actually before that, because um, I feel like I didn't know as much then, even though I read a lot, but not knowing um, all the brain and lungs that and are developing. I'm supposed to lay awake in my room. Okay. Knowing the brain um, development and lung development that goes on in these final weeks. And I was just so anxious. We could not wait for baby to be born. Well, this time around, I feel like everybody's like, oh, I feel like I'm not going to see you next week. Or I feel like I'm not going to see you in a couple days because you're going to have the baby. And I'm just like, shut your mouth. I want this baby to stay in as long as possible because we have so much still to get done and I am not ready. <laughs> I, um, yes, we're very excited. Uh, you are very excited, aren't you? Very excited. I need to get this truck. Okay. Okay, wait one second. Ruben, wait. So, yes, I mean, we like just are getting the baby's room together and there's still so much around the house since we moved about a month and a half, two months ago now. And for work, that things that I need to get done and get in place and set up. So I'm just like, Wait, baby, Bobby, stay uh, inside. Uh, All right, so yes, so this, we're gonna start a little series about getting ready for baby. And I will show you around uh, baby's room at the moment, which is kind of a mess, but we're slowly just unpacking boxes, seeing what we have and seeing what we need to get. All right, so here is baby's room. We have some boxes still, like just moved out because we've been trying to get everything we can. And there's books stacked up, stuff stacked up on the changing table. We found some fun toys last night, didn't we? What is that, bud? A, a clay truck that goes like a little swivel and sinks, and you can pull it like that with that string and, and lift it like this. And then it's here, and then the toy has it with this little string, and it comes with a little sink and swivel. But Are you rediscovering all your favorite toys from when you were and, younger? And this is a little tray that is that's just detached. Yeah. Uh, don't really attach it now. And I'll, I'll tell you the rest. It's a toy. That's it. But basically I have stacks of diaper bags, stacks of carriers, boppies, baby proofing stuff, baby books that we're going to go through. Play this helicopter comes with its own lifting ski, wheels on the bottom of the ski, and a little pirate. Very cool. And a button that in and out the ski, a spinning propeller, music that needs to retain its battery. Oh. And. And uh, there's a 
music clip. Also, this is edit also. Yeah. All right, so he's rediscovering all his toys. There's boxes of more baby toys. We found, like, the baby, baby infant toys, um, which are downstairs to clean and stuff we have to get out of the box. Closet that's getting organized. And at least we finally got the crib together and bassin that off last night. Um, still need to get, like, the sheets and stuff on the crib. Um, and we put the pack-and-play bassinet in our room and set that up because that's where baby will be for the first few months um, sleeping rooming in um, and basically we're just going through everything so it's a process of going through everything we have packed up from him to see what we have what we need because he was a summer baby um, also see like if there's super gendered um, clothing depending on what we have and like putting that certain places so when baby arrives we see if it works if baby's boy or girl and seeing how big baby's gonna be because I have like this feeling that baby's gonna be big I don't know why but I'm just worried um and see if baby will fit into any of the clothes what all we need to get since it's the middle of the winter and so on so Welcome to Getting Ready for Baby.